If you've been to downtown Caldwell recently, you've probably noticed these new parking meter boxes scattered all along the main streets. I'm your neighborhood reporter Brady Kasky on 7th Avenue, and I spoke with some local business owners to see how they feel about the switch to paid parking. A new parking system will be coming soon to downtown Caldwell. Although the city recently installed these parking meters, downtown visitors won't have to pay to park until sometime in May. I do think that there is going to be a little bit of a challenge in the beginning. Christina Rock owns Spectagals in downtown Caldwell, a boutique shop offering eyewear and other gifts. She tells me downtown parking can be a challenge for her customers. I hope that our community will understand that there's a situation with parking and this is hopefully going to um, help. Don Bayshore owns the nearby Fire and Ice Pottery Studio and says parking directly impacts her customers too. It's vital. I have a lot of customers that are elderly and can't walk very far. Their ability to get here and park somewhere close is important to my business. Bayshore fears the added dollar an hour cost could turn people away from stopping by her studio at all. It's going to have a dramatic impact. Talking to my customers, you know, with the economy the way that it is, they can't afford to pay to park in addition to paying to come in and do something at my studio. So if the cost is going to be even greater for them to come here, I'm going to lose business. City leaders say that the new program aims to alleviate congestion by encouraging long-term parkers, like local employees, to park in the free parking lots a few blocks from the core of downtown. Time will tell, and then also time will tell of whether or not um, businesses can sustain through it all, and hopefully we can. Given these big changes in parking, Caldwell City leaders are trying to work with local business owners to answer questions and get feedback at a public meeting this upcoming Monday. In downtown Caldwell, I'm your neighborhood reporter Brady Kasky for Idaho News 6.